Hey there. In this video, we are going to look at what a system of linear equations is, and we'll get into what it means to solve a system of linear equations. So if we have two linear equations with two variables, then we have a system of linear equations. Solving a system of linear equations means that we are finding the set of variables x comma y, so an ordered pair that is a solution to both equations. And notice it's to both equations. So for example, if I had 3x plus 2y equals 4 and 4x plus 7y equals 9, this the um, two equations here form a system of linear equations. The ordered pair, whatever it is, x comma y, that um, is a solution to both of these equations is going to be the solution to the entire system. So there are two primary methods we will look at in this unit, and that will be substitution and elimination. And those two methods will help us to solve a system of linear equations algebraically. Now, really quick to note, um, we can look visually. While this is technically a method to solve systems of equations, it is not as um, a, efficient or not as accurate as solving algebraically, but I just wanted to give you a visual really quick of what you're finding when you solve for that ordered pair. So if we have two lines, and I give you two examples here, if we have two lines that are graphed on the same graph, the point where they cross, that ordered pair is going to be the solution to that system because that is the only point where um, it is a solution to both of those equations. It's a point on both of those lines. So the point where those two lines cross is going to be the solution of the system. And that is the point that you are finding when you solve algebraically with substitution or elimination. So that was a quick video, but um, again, just wanted to touch on that system of linear equations. So we've got uh, two variables and two equations. Typically it's X and Y, but it could be any two variables. And the solution, remember, is going to be that point where they cross. That's what it actually represents. And we always write that as an ordered pair, um, x comma y, whatever those numbers are. 